guys it is monday the 28th of december so if you are new to my channel i am rachel and i'm on the slimming world plan i've lost five and a half stone following slimming world i am a target member however i am considering changing my target for the new year but we shall see so today is another what i eat in the day whilst following the slimming world plan and as you can see i've just got back in i've uh, this morning's been quite busy it is half past 11 i've not had any breakfast yet we asked the food shopping come so i've recorded that got that all away and um, my lovely consultant has set up in the back of her car in the car park at our local welfare with the new book so yeah i've been to go and fetch that and she was also selling the hi-fi bars and magazines so i've picked up a magazine and a box of hi-fi bars and i'm having Ooh, i'm having i'm looking forward to having a look through the book as well there's 84 recipes in there so that will be nice to have a read of that i will show you them in a moment Declan's just got up good morning Declan. Mm. well nearly afternoon so yeah not had anything to eat yet so i am going to get some breakfast ready now and then probably have a a lighter later lunch hi hi so um yeah without uh blurring on too much i'll just show you what i got from swimming world and then i'll get my breakfast just show you the uh, slimming world magazine so i fetched that fetched a box of the seduce me salted caramel these are my favorite and then this is the book that fresh start feeling um because obviously it's a, oops, sorry, it is a fresh start once we start after we've been off plan so yeah there's some nice looking uh, meal ideas in there and some recipes so i am looking forward to giving that a good read later so i'll see you in a minute for breakfast hi guys so welcome to weighing update the first one after christmas oh my lord i'd have preferred if i'd have decided to miss this one out however i'm sort of glad that i haven't because it is going to help keep me motivated so i'm not really gonna drag on obviously i had new new year when i've new year have we I'm, i'll be off plan for new year's eve and new year's day um, but then on the 2nd of january i'll be i'll be full throttle ahead back fully on plan so christmas eve i had off plan we ordered a takeaway it was absolutely gorgeous I will admit, I probably carried on eating, even when my stomach said, you've had enough. I just wanted to make the most of it. I don't know what it is. I just, I saw it as a challenge. I thought, well, I don't normally have this kind of food. So, um, yeah, I was, I was very, very naughty. And it was the first time we've ever had from um, this place. And it was absolutely gorgeous. So, it was worth it. I enjoyed it. Christmas Day. Um, had takeaway for breakfast <laughs> a slice of pizza for breakfast on christmas day i mean just met the most of it that's what i did um christmas dinner was near enough on plan there was a few like little extra bits on there that you don't normally have like your pigs and blankets um and then i was enjoying some cobs that night with the white cobs and oh my lord the white cobs were just amazing and then boxing day was buffet food um some more white cobs <laughs> oh they were amazing yeah i really did enjoy them and then obviously yesterday back on plan and i was so glad to be back on plan as much as i enjoyed the white cobs as much as i enjoyed the chocolates saying that i actually didn't eat that many chocolates but the ones that i did have i did really enjoy um but i was ready to get back on plan i felt crappy my stomach was so bloated i didn't know where to put it um tired couldn't be bothered but now i'm feeling really really good today despite the scales but um it was expected what was going to happen today so i'm not gonna drag on <laughs> let's get into it shall we so last monday i weighed the lightest i can remember weighing for pff, i haven't got a clue how long probably when i was at school really so i weighed 12 stone one and a half pounds my target is 12 stone 6. 
I've sort of gone over my target. I'm still in my target, however, but I've gone over my target. I've weighed in this morning at 12 stone 7, so I've put five and a half pound on. Five and a half pound over like two days and one meal. Hey, I know it's water. I hope it's water. Um, yeah, it is what it is. I'm not going to beat myself up. I enjoyed it. And I shall enjoy getting it back off and I shall enjoy New Year's Eve and New Year's Day and then that'll be it. And, well, we'll talk a bit more closer to the time where I plan on going with my weight loss and what my new target is going to be. Yeah, let's save that one, shall we, for another day. Let's uh, get everything out of the way first and, yeah, make the most of it. So, I've got... One day, full day yesterday, back on plan under my belt. Today is going to be the same. So, yeah, I'm feeling really positive about it. Um, my consultant has been in touch. She's setting up outside our welfare to go and pick up the new books. I'm going to go and fetch that. And hopefully, I think she says she's got some hi-fi bars and some magazines as well. So, yeah, I'm going to go and fetch them. I hope a bit more of the motivation. And I'm absolutely loving the new Pinch and Arm cookbook. Looking forward to making the Viking pork tonight. So hopefully, fingers crossed, that'll be nice. But uh, yeah, other than that, I am back on plan until Thursday night. So I've got a few days to turn this round. I'm feeling quite positive, actually. If, fingers crossed, around 12 stone 7... I'm going to put myself under pressure here. If I can lose £2 for my next weigh-in, so if I can weigh in about 12 stone £5, I be very, very happy. So that gives me some days to be fully on plan, day and a bit off plan, back on it. So, yeah, that is, I'm, I'm setting myself a target of losing £2 by next week. So, fingers crossed. And there's only me that can do it and that's how it's going to be. So I wish you all the best of luck for your weigh-ins. Do not beat yourself up, whatever that gain is. If you've got a gain and you've enjoyed your Christmas, do not beat yourself up about it. We'll get back on it. It'll come off. You know you can do it. So as long as you've enjoyed it. That's all that matters. It's not like we're doing it every day of the year, is it? And I think after this year that we've had, it was definitely needed a good blowout. So, yes. And if you've had a loss, well done. Absolutely fantastic. And I take my hat off to you because that takes some dedication. So, and if you've been lucky enough to have a maintain as well, then that's brilliant. But uh, I'm in the gain park this week, but I don't mind. It was worth it and I enjoyed it. So I'm going to shut up, I'm going to go down, I've got Az to come in, so yeah, go and crack on with all that and I will see you throughout with whatever I'm eating. So guys, have a fantastic day, whatever day it is that you're watching this and stay safe. Hi guys, so breakfast, I have got 40 grams of the Honey Monster Wheat Puffs for my first healthy extra B, well my only healthy extra B. I've got 200 mils of semi-skim milk in there as part of my first healthy extra A. I've got a cup of coffee using 20 mils of semi-skim milk, so that is part of my first healthy extra A. And I've got some watermelon for speed. So breakfast is sin-free, one healthy extra B and part of one healthy extra A. So I shall catch you later for lunch. Hi guys, so with having me breakfast a bit later, I'm not really too hungry. However, this is to stop me from grabbing something I shouldn't. So I've got a banana, which is free. Two clementines, which is speed, and a Muller light gingerbread yogurt for half a sin. So that puts me so far today on half a sin. So I will catch you later for lunch. Hi guys, so tea for tonight, and boy, I can't wait to tuck into this. Go get my words out. So this is the Viking pork out of the new Pinch of Nom Quick and Easy Cookbook. So it is pork loin steak with the excess fat removed so that's free in the protein it is topped with onions which is speed there is 40 grams of reduced 
cheese on there for me i think it's just adding this like egg yolk and mustard powder and worcestershire sauce mixed into that and you, you grill it and then pop it on the top until the cheese melts it smells divine so i'm looking forward to trying it and i'll let you know what i think i've got some roast potatoes that are just done with some fry light in the air fryer so they are free and then for some speed i've got some broccoli carrots and brussels sprouts so it's sin free for dinner and it's my second healthy extra a and i'm also having a glass of sugar-free orange and pineapple squash so i am on so far today half a sin so i will catch you later for snacks hi guys so that viking pork me and declan absolutely loved it alan wasn't so keen on it but Declan and I will definitely be having that again. I thoroughly enjoyed it. So yeah, thumbs up from me and Declan. So for snacks tonight, I've got a bowl of watermelon, which is speed. I'm having another gingerbread yogurt because obviously the date on them is quite a few in there that have got the 30th on. So it's half a sin for that. And I'm also having a timeout wafer. It's the five and a half sin one. So it's six sins for snacks, which means I am finishing today on six and a half sins so good on plan day and uh, thank you very much for watching and i will be back again tomorrow with another what i eat and do whilst following the slimming well plan so guys until then take care and stay safe bye